But the thing to note here is because we've got it wired in twinning CPC cable, our CPC is sized at 1.5 millimeter squared and our line and neutral conductor, so our live conductor is at 2.5 millimeter squared. Now, what that means is we would expect the CPC end-to-end -end values to be 1.67 times greater than that of our live conductors. So if we did the calculation one ohm times 1.67, we should get a value of 1.67 ohms. Difficult maths there, loving your style, Marcus. I know normally, you're your... normally Joe's thing, I'm not very good at maths. We've got 1.68, again, I would be happy with that. Oh, and it's just dropped to 1.67 ohms, so so again, it's, it's spot on. And, and one of the things I like when I deliver this in the classroom is learners find it magical when that calculations actually work.